I can't believe I'm saying this, but gaming on Mac never felt this good. Playing titles like Warzone with full ray tracing and hitting over 130 FPS, that is no longer a dream for Mac user. If you are sick of running your favorite games at 1080p and your performance standards are way too high for your Mac to keep up, then honestly, cloud gaming might just become your new best friend. I've been testing a different games and now I got a pretty solid picture of how it works and how to get the best performance out of it. Just a quick heads up, this is the main factor that makes cloud gaming running really smooth on Mac. This is the Deco B63 from TP-Link and this is a Wi-Fi 7 router. So in this video, we are going to break it down and see how it works and why such a future-proofing router. But first, let's talk about the game performance. There's no better test than a game that doesn't even open on my Mac, Call of Duty Warzone. It's run perfectly at 100 to 110 FPS at 4Ks and extreme graphic settings, and even higher FPS if I turn on the DLSS frame generation. I'm actually super impressed with the quality. The image look amazing, and there's basically no input lag at all. Mouse and keyboard feels great, even the controller works perfectly. The control feels almost identical to playing the game natively. And even with games that can run natively on Mac, like Cyberpunk 2077, cloud gaming gives you a completely different experience. I finally get to see ray tracing and path tracing fully enabled at Uncha setting. Everything looks insanely realistic. And the performance? Rock solid sitting around 60 to 65 FPS, totally playable. So everything looks like it was working fine, except for one thing, the game streaming was stutter like crazy. I'm pretty sure you already noticed in the footage, it completely killed the whole gaming experience. At first, I thought the problem was my Mac video decoding, or maybe GeForce Now was using some low-end host computer, but that is not even the case. The real issue was my internet. I was still using the 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi for my ISP original gateway. I mean, it's fine for watching YouTube or basic browsing, but for cloud gaming, which needs super stable, low latency performance, it just can't keep up. So I basically have no choice but upgrading my Wi-Fi system. And this time I choose the Deco B63 from TP-Link. And this one, as I introduced, is this a Wi-Fi 7 and it has a lot of feature. It is literally everything you need from a modern network. It is Wi-Fi 7, which means lower latency and way faster speed compared to the previous generation. It also has double the channel width compared with my old Wi-Fi 6 gateway, up to 300 MHz on a 6 GHz band. So you get a way lower latency and less congestion, especially for high bandwidth tasks like cloud gaming. But the best part is the MLO feature. That means it can use all the available Wi-Fi bands like 2.4, 5, or 6 GHz at the same time instead of a single band connection. That means if one band get congested, it can switch dynamically without dropping your connection. And that is super important for things like streaming or cloud gaming where stability matters even more than raw speed. So upgrading sounds like really serious, but all I have to do was actually just plug in the deco into the powers and then use the ethernet port plug one end into this port and then another one into one of this from my gateway. Then came to the moment of truth. I ran a speed test and yeah, the internet was definitely faster compared to before. You might not see a huge difference on the internet speed based on my test, but it actually come from my internet plan. I'm still using a regular cable internet plan. But if you are using fiber and you plug the light directly into this port, you will instantly get a much better internet speed. Because this router using 2.5 gigabit port instead of 1 gigabit port on the regular gateway, which means 2 by times faster in transfer speed. So if you are on the low tier internet plan, something like 1 gig, upgrading to this router is actually future-proofing your setup. So when you're moving to fiber, you don't have to change your router once again. So back to cloud gaming, I tested it again, and even though the speed was faster, there was still some stuttering, very little in improvement. And at that point I was like, okay, so better in Wi-Fi speed wasn't removing stutter. So what is the problems? After doing some research, it totally makes sense. Wi-Fi is basically just a fancy radio. It has to find with signal from all the router and it get affected by wall, 
distant, interferes, and etc. So I realized I need a better connection method. So I bought this Cat6 Ethernet cable and connected it straight from my Deco to my Mac Mini. And boom, I was right. My internet speed was never the issue. All that stuttering was just Wi-Fi jitter. After switching to a LAN connection to the high-speed port on the Deco BE63, the difference was instant. It feel amazing to play now, no quality drop, no input lag, nothing I can complain. It's not just for gaming, having a fast internet port will save you a ton of time if you are transferring or backing up files between multiple devices on your network. The Deco B63 also support wires and wireless backhoe, or even combination of both to create a full mesh Wi-Fi system. So if you have a big house or a two-floor setup, you only need one router connected to the internet. Then you can play a second unit upstairs and connect it using wireless backhoe. But of course, using the wire backhouse for the strongest and stable Wi-Fi signal. If you get the own three-pack combos, you can cover up to 7,200 square feet. That is a huge amount amount of space, on with stable, high-speed Wi-Fi throughout your entire home. So if you are really into gaming, upgrading to one of these Wi-Fi 7 routers make a lot of sense. It gives you a much better internet, more stability, and the most important thing is future-proofing your setup. If you want to learn more about this Deco B63, I will drop the link right below so you can check out all the details. And if you are thinking about buying it, now is the perfect time. It is Black Friday and the price is discount. So definitely go and take a look. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you soon in the next video.